thanks for joining me. Uh, it's going to be a little bit different of a video. <clears throat> I think I have this flavor up, but what I'm going to do, instead of making it in a 30 ml bottle, I'm going to be making it in a 330 ml bottle. Uh, same recipes, it's just on a bigger scale and it's just to show more of this is a, a, a how you do a bigger bigger volume of e-liquid um, and I'm still a little nervous to try on a scale but that's okay uh, I'm going to be using graduated cylinders and they seem to work just fine for me. Uh, I'll put a link in the description to where you can pick up some graduated cylinders on Amazon. It's where I got them. Uh, I'm not, they didn't sponsor this. It, it, it's just where I found them for a, a decent price. I did. I am using glass cylinders because they hold up better to the uh, vegetable glycerin. All right. We're down on the table. You can see the graduated cylinder. It's not focusing on on it very well. There we go. Look at that. And for this recipe, it's going to be six percent uh, fruit circles from uh, TFA. So that is. Nineteen point eight milliliters. So I'm just going to round off to twenty because I can. And if you've never used a graduated cylinder, there's what's called a meniscus. Uh, a little bit extra but here's the, the flavor yes it's a big ass bottle uh, the meniscus is geez babe sorry where the liquid actually goes like this and that's where you get your actual measurement from so the more you know now this would be better if I was using a scale because I could get every last drop and make sure it is every last drop but I used a little uh, a little bit extra so that's okay and we're gonna be using strawberry ripe uh, from TFA as well and we're only using one percent of this guy sorry for the mess behind the, the workstation there it, it, it's a work in progress 330 times times one equals three point three. Should be able to do that in my head, right? And for this one, I'm going to use a syringe. In this one, I actually want to use just a little bit less because strawberry ripe is such a strong flavor that I don't. Uh, I don't want too much of it. Nick tea. Shake it, shake it, shake it. And it's going to be 9.9 .9 mils. And again, this is for 330 mils. So I'm going to use a syringe again because I don't want to have any overpour. Uh, on my desk. Just a little bit more. You can't even see what I'm doing there. Oh, 
just a little under 10 mils. I'm okay with it not being exactly 3 mils, by the way. Probably would have been easier if I took the, uh, the blunt tip off, but hey, you live and you learn, right? Now it's time for the vegetable glycerin. Since this is a Maximus VG, yes, I don't even know what that's supposed to mean. Now, I don't have enough in this jar, that's okay. It's time to wash that jar anyway. Here's my, my small jug of VG. It's a little bit full. This is actually a gallon of vegetable glycerin. This is one of the four that is in the possible giveaway. Well, not this particular one, but that size. Now, I don't mind that there's not as much room to shake this because it's going to steep for quite a while. Let's go back up top real quick. And we're back. Uh, again, that was a quick and easy recipe. It's one of mine and my wife's favorite uh, uh, flavors. Um, let me just make sure I don't have it up on ELR. Recipes. Let's just make sure I don't have it up. Uh, over there, which I very well may. I should have checked that before, I apologize. And I do not have that that uh, recipe up. Now, and I, I, I don't remember why now. It's actually from a local vape shop that recently closed. It's damn close to the recipe, but not 100%. They call it one thing. What I'm going to call it is uh, Two Cans Revenge. Uh, just for fun. You know, I'll put that up on ELR. I'll put the link down below. Again, uh, thanks for joining me. Make sure you all are uh, advocating. Mix safe. And uh, let's vape on, guys.